Привіт! I'm Taya from Ukraine and welcome to my channel again. Today, guys, I'm going to show you France a little bit, where I'm staying and how's life treating me right now in France. So there are two options that I could do. First one, apply for refugee status. How I told you before, you have to give up your passport and wait unlimited amount of time uh, when you can get a European passport. This is not an option for me, so I choose temporary protection. What does it mean? I got this paper and it means that I'm uh, under protection of France. I can get free stuff, for example, food, transport, medical insurance. Also, I can work with it as far as I know and study. It lasts around six months and after that uh, no one knows what happens because I think the European government will decide depends on how war is um, uh, going on in Ukraine. I can go to Ukraine and come back to France as far as I know so no problems with that because I don't want to stay here for a very long time I miss my home uh, I miss people I have there so I would honestly love to visit Kiev next month even though people are saying oh it's clear you can do it now it's still uh, very dangerous because uh, you don't know what happens tomorrow plus there are a lot of mines everywhere so our government does not recommend to hurry up with this decision Just for you guys, I think the view was worth it. <laughs> Waking up early and arriving around uh, 8 a.m. at the office, I was able to make all the documents needed for one day. There are queues and you line in American English and you need to spend the whole day doing these documents, but hopefully they made uh, one place for uh, this stuff so I don't have to go you know every day to different places and locations so I arranged everything at one location I'm here in Lyon if you don't know it because my sister is working here the card for transport uh, it is the same card as for buses for metro lasts around one month and we asked what happens next next they still don't know that so uh, unlike Poland, where you don't have any card, you just go <laughs> with your passport to any transport you need. Here you have a card, plus uh, since there is no uh, interaction with people at the transport at all, unlike Ukraine. By the way, I will definitely make a video about differences between France and Ukraine that I noticed. And uh, no one would check that, so you need to have car to just enter to the metro. The biggest concern was can I, how long can I stay here? So they made, uh, so now it's easier with this temporary protection card. I need to worry about uh, breaking the rules and stuff like this with the visa. Also, if you have a zero level in French, they provide free classes. I think I have a two level in French. However, uh, it depends on a group if they have enough people to make such classes. But uh, for my mother, it's very difficult because she doesn't know any French at all. So for her, everything was um, extremely new, the sounds. Uh, uh, all the time like this so for me I just need to learn more uh, words and no problem at all uh, but for her it's like learning from scratch and other people I met at 
yeah, fun, fun French people. And other people I met at the um, uh, temporary protection governmental place. They don't speak any French at all. I can't imagine what it's like. Even with my level, I feel I need to learn more and I don't understand everything. But <laughs> with their level, since a lot of French people, they don't want or they can't speak English. So it's uh, a bit difficult. Here are some old Lyon for you, Vieux Lyon, and I think the architecture is very nice, very old. It's very good that people preserve it and they still leave it. That's amazing. So for us, uh, you have it uh, only in the city center in Kyiv, for example. I hope all sightings are really preserved in Kyiv because Honestly, I miss the places I know, <laughs> even though as a tour guide, I'm, uh, you know, seeing those places a lot, but still, I miss them. Uh, so as far as for what I do here, uh, you know, guys, or who doesn't know that I don't have a higher degree, so I can't get a really uh, qualified job anywhere. Maybe I can get a job with uh, when I know some people because I know a few languages only because of that that's what I rely on right now um, my online uh, business my services and of course you my YouTube thank you so much I really want to thank everyone who helped me personally who helped my father battalion uh, he is uh, really happy and most of the money goes to the patrol if you want to support me, you know where to go. You can go in the links down below. I left all the uh, information, vice, paypal, money. It's number one problem, honestly, saying. Uh, if you don't know anyone here, you need to find temporary uh, apartment or house, and then you need to write it in your documents, temporary protection, because after that you can, with this address, you can, uh, you know, get the food because you need to go there. So it's a bit uh, complicated. Even though I have applied for the accommodation, there is no guarantee when it's going to be uh, how quality is going to be because the priorities are children and seniors and among my family there is no children or seniors who came with me only dog and so uh, happy to honestly have acquaintances here and help me with this question because this is the most expensive and the most um, complicated question to deal with next one is food I came today to get uh, food, what I can get to see how it works. So it's a, such, a, such a small counter, like a small shop in the village, it reminds me of, the, of which people are very hostile, grannies and grandpas usually they are some young people, but they are very smiling anyway. And uh, they give you honestly pretty quality food, uh, they even give you fresh fruit, vegetables. And what shocked me is fresh raspberry, which even in Ukraine, regular people do not buy when it's not a season. And for example, uh, a big cheese, big bag of cheese and also lots of bread and some vegetables that uh, I don't even know what is that. We don't have that in Ukraine. Uh, overall, it was good. Uh, not a lot of meat, uh, just two small steaks for two people, but the bags were pretty big and I'm pretty happy with that. About money. They give you some support, uh, money, some card. Uh, it will be activated in a month and you get around 300 euros per person adult but if you work after all then you 
cannot get that money or it will be shrinked and also the food also uh, you can't get or it will be shrinked as well. Believe it or not, for me going abroad was always like a holiday, some new experience and you usually appreciate every day being abroad, but now you don't really have much mood to see all the sightings and you are kind of living uh, in a waiting mood uh, and you don't care about all this beautiful stuff you see, but they at least make your day and uh, you don't uh, feel stress because of uh, the news you are reading all the time so you can always um, how to say find what to do what to see uh, to forget about uh, for a few moments uh, about that, that awful stuff going on in my country i hope you enjoyed this type uh, of video such format vlog walking and also knowing how am i uh, let me know uh, what uh, kind of type of videos you like because uh, it all depends on you you know how to show that you have to give a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel give me a comments it promotes my videos on youtube and uh, of course send me good vibes i always read your comments even if i don't answer to all of them but uh, believe me i read most of your comments so i'm very happy to hear nice words from you guys thank you so much for watching i appreciate having you also subscribe to all my social media follow me on instagram facebook page also you can uh, subscribe to receive newsletter from my site don't forget that if you are if you want to learn the language i have the app learning app um, with alphabet and also we added lots of words recently so you can also find it in the links down below for uh, play market or app store i wish you good easter guys don't forget that our easter will be in a week and don't forget to keep smiling see you in my next episode bye bye